Hey you guys, it's your girl Kia V all up in the building, all up on your screen. And today we are going to be talking about some Prada for your mama dupes, okay? Prada for your mama dupes. So I actually came across, I want to say this season's most popular Prada shoes. And they are these beautiful crystallized embellished shoes. And the very first one that I saw are the Prada Crystal Logo Loafers. Look at these you guys. These are absolutely beautiful. I've seen videos of these and the way that they twinkle in the light when you just move them in the reflection, absolutely phenomenal. Am I a loafer girl? I don't know, but I'm absolutely here for it. Here's another version or another way of the shoes being portrayed. You can see up here, it has all of these clusters of crystals with the Prada Triangle logo in the front. These are absolutely beautiful. So I did see these. And then, listen, one night I was on Fashion of the Nova. Listen, you already know. Fashion Nova. And they had a pair of dupes that I was just like, mmm. I want to see, I want to see. Because what I didn't tell you about this shoe is that this shoe costs $1,750. Good dollars. Yes. Almost $2,000. For crystal loafers. L crystal loafers for $2,000. So, listen. This is a better alternative for anybody. These are called the Maddie Rhinestone Loafers in the color black. Um, and these, I got them for $35. <laughs> $35. So, let's check them out and see if they disappoint. Because I am actually looking forward to the... Looking forward to these. You guys... I'm going to take the little tissue paper off before I show you. Hmm. Let me put the box down. So these are the loafers. You see how these are just shining, 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 shining. Yay. All it is to win in. You guys, these are absolutely beautiful. Why are these giving me your butt is mine? Let me tell you right. I feel a genius. Not my love. Oh, she's just a girl that thinks that I am the one to do, 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 do. But the kid is not my son. <laughs> no lie, you guys. These are giving me Michael Jackson loafer vibes. Like all of this blinginess. The loafers in itself. Now, you guys, I'm technically not like a loafer girl. I did have some that I stole from my sister back in the day. Or pretty much it was hand-me-down to me. And I loved them and I would wear them all the time. But outside of that, I have never like went and reached for a loafer until now. But listen, what a great way to get back into them. These are literally shining all over the camera. My gosh. Okay, Fashion Nova. So I did go up a size because Fashion Nova shoes tend to run small. Um, and I don't like that. So to be on the safe side, I did go up a half size or a full size. So these are in a size 10. I am normally a 9 in women's. So that's my only advice to you when it comes to Fashion Nova shoes is to make sure you go up. Okay? Unless you feel comfortable going true to size. That's on you, sis. But these are absolutely beautiful. And what I love about them is look at the bottoms. These are like very like sturdy. They have the ridges and everything. Now, would you be wearing this in like snow and stuff? I don't think I would. <laughs> I don't think I would. But these are so freaking beautiful. And I wanted a nice like blingy type of flat shoe. These are absolutely beautiful and perfect. I'm totally here for them. Do you guys think that this is a good dupe for the Prada ones? What do you think? Because I feel like they are. The only thing that these are missing that the Prada one has is the triangle. But listen, we are going to compare. Do I need to zoom up a little more? What are, what are we thinking? What Did they do pretty good? Because I think Fashion Nova did that. The cheaper version, for sure. So these were, like I said, $35. Um, they had a sale going on when I got them. I think they're technically like $50. Bucks. Um, so, yeah, just check. 
because thirty five dollars and fifty bucks totally two different things. But I love them. The it's not sticky. Now I know the thing about the Prada ones are that they are crystals on top of satin. This just feels like a basic, like kind of a basic new buck material. Probably a cheap new buck. A cheap new buck. So yeah, but they seem very stable. They don't feel like they will come off. I don't know how, you know, <laughs> I don't know how long they will last on the shoe. So don't give me the lion, okay? This is my first time trying them out. Will I lose one along the way? I do not doubt it. But I see that they're not like, I don't know, they're weird. You see how they like going all over the place? But they look okay from far away. So I don't know how that works, but... That's kind of interesting. <laughs> Look at them. Are we missing something, darling? <laughs> I don't know. I don't I don't know. That's how it is in the front of this one. Oh, I'm just not seeing that. This seam is not seamless. Nonetheless, I'm gonna wear these, okay? These are gonna be my new little dress shoes. I think these are absolutely cute. Now, I do know that they're starting to sell out of sizes on the website. So, they do have another pair that I saw on ASOS website. And they are $45. And this is what they look like. So, they pretty much look like mine. If they aren't, <laughs> you know, officially mine. But they pretty much look like mine. And like I said, these are called the ASOS Million Chunky Embellished Loafers on the ASOS website. Um, $45. The only difference between mine and theirs is this bottom. You see how their bottoms are flat and mines have like traction. That's the only thing. And I would be nervous for these in a the winter time. These I would be nervous of, but I feel like the traction might help me a little bit. So yeah, yeah, definitely check it out on ASOS if you are interested in the silhouette, but you are not interested in spending a million bucks. So the next shoe I'm gonna talk to you guys about, I also saw on a Prada website and they are called the Prada Satin Slingback Pumps with Crystals. And these are those babies. They have this little baby like kitten heel. Absolutely love them. I think it's cute. The top of it, they just have the silhouette of the Prada symbol triangle, but it's covered or embellished in crystals. These cost $1,520. You want to see the backs of them? <laughs> Here are the backs of these shoes. I think that they're cute in their own way, but even then, can you see that the crystals don't line up? So I guess uh, that's just the, tw the trend of these things is that they don't really necessarily completely cover the shoe. They will have like spots and stuff I, I don't know i guess but this is how it looks on the prada website this picture is directly from them when it comes to this shoe um but i actually think that these are kind of cute i love the whole point, pointed toe aspect of it all i think it's really cute listen don't ask me i think they're cute i don't own these but you know what i'm not paying one thousand five hundred dollars for them either but i might just get my hands on a dupe that are on public desire and these are them these are called the galaxy black sparkly heels and they are 41 dollars 99 on the website and you guys now granted these don't look exactly like the products that's why i call them dupes because they're not exactly like the product but it's giving Prada vibes, is it not? Look at that. The triangle, the crystals. Only difference is I feel like the heel height. It's not a little baby kitten heel and it's not black in the back. Because if you see the backs of the shoe, this is the one on ASOS or no, Public Desire. You see how they have the crystals on the back of the heel. And you guys know the ones on Prada is just a basic black heel. So, I mean, they definitely have differences. Like, this one is a sling back with the strap. This one is, like, a sling back, except for it has the tie-me-up, tie-me-down strings on the back of them. So, yeah, but it's dang near close. You know what I mean? I feel like it'll serve its purpose for the look that you want. If you want that Prada look with the crystals and the embellishments, there are other alternatives to get that. And these are definitely it. So I think that those dupes are absolutely perfect for that shoe, as well as these for the loafers. So what do you think? Am I reaching? 
Am I reaching? Because I will be reaching for these. Like, these will definitely be worn. These are super cute. So, yeah, I'm going to try to find these on the Fashion Nova website and post them in my description box along with the Public Desire ones. Um, in case you guys are interested in buying the dupes for these Prada shoes. Because, listen, I just saved you, what, $3,000, $4,000? And these two shoes didn't even come up to 100 So, <laughs> you're welcome. I think these are absolutely cute, though. And they're on sale even more, I think, on the website. So, I'm definitely going to leak this. I'm going to try to post this up um, soon enough so that you'll be able to get it. But I do have other content in front of it. But listen, they'll be up and hopefully they'll still be on sale and in stock. So, yeah. So, that's today's video. I absolutely love these. I think these are so pretty. I'm going to be moonwalking all around folks' lives in these. All around them. But these are so cute. And I think that these are excellent dupes. And I'm actually fine with not having a little triangle motif, whatever you want to call it, pendant in the front of it. These are totally fine. And these are totally me. You all know I love shiny things. So, yeah. That's today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you have any other dupes for the Prada shoes, let me know in the comment section. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And you already know I will see you later. Bye.